Here's how you apply knockdown texture. First, you want to prime the area to be textured to allow for proper adhesion. Next, you can prep the texture can by shaking it for one full minute until you hear that marble start to rattle. You may not hear that marble immediately, but it'll come. Then you can spray it into a trash can to clear the nozzle and allow for proper spray pattern and product consistency. You can also practice spraying on a piece of cardboard to familiarize yourself with the product and to practice matching to your existing pattern. When you're doing your practice spray on that cardboard, you can also use that as an opportunity to set up your dry times and practice using your knockdown knife. Now you're ready to retexture the area. Apply the texture in a continuous circular motion, feathering the texture into the existing pattern. You want to allow that product to set up for one to three minutes. If you let the texture dry too long, when you go to put that knockdown knife on it, it's not going to knock down. Then using the knockdown knife, you can lightly knock down that texture by holding the knife parallel to the wall, being careful not to apply too much pressure as this may remove the texture from the wall. Heavier patterns may require more than one coat. Once it's dry, simply paint the area. When you're finished and before you store the product, make sure you clean the nozzle out by tipping it upside down in a trash can and spraying it until it comes out clear. For more Homax projects and product information, check out homaxproducts.com.